look at the mountains. Look at the sky, oh my goodness. That is just a beautiful photo right there. Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 11. It is my cousin's birthday today. So I always remember her birthday one and then when her birthday hits, I know Christmas is two weeks away. Today is an exciting day because I don't have any work and I'm going to get the massage done that usually makes me feel better for like seven to 10 days. So I also have an appointment to get my nails done today. And I think I've decided on the colors. My nails are actually very healthy and very long right now. I'm pretty happy about like the length. So I might ask them to keep it like pretty close to this length and just keep the shape round. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have like a mauve kind of purple color for all of the nails. And then I want some like shimmery, either silver or like rose gold on the ring finger. So we'll see how that goes. I found inspo on Pinterest. But like I said, probably like two, three weeks ago, I only get my nails done like once a year. And that's a tradition that only started my freshman year of college because we just did it every year before our conference meet because they would peel if you did them on your own. So we would just go get gel manicures done essentially before before our big competition so that it would look nice the entire time. I had a lot of rules because I was a flyer that I couldn't have like super dark colors because it made your hands easier to see on turns. So, I mean, I don't have that now, so it doesn't matter. But yeah, I am excited for this. I've got about an hour and a half until I need to be at my appointment, cross Granville Bridge, go grocery shopping because I've already finished the bone broth in a day. Ooh, let's plug in Christmas lights first. Let's do that. Love it. It's always such a big delay. So much clearer in here. I'm so glad. But I will also take down some of the recycling pieces of cardboard while I leave for my appointment because, like, I just have to. There's nowhere else for them to go. <laughs> So the treatment went well. I am seeing her again in one week and then I won't see her again until like the second or third week of January because she's taking off at the beginning of next year. And I got a bunch of groceries that I'm now gonna unpack. And then I have my nail appointment at 2.30. So it's like 1.15. The city is vibing right now. Time lapse. Grapes, oatmeal, bone broth. I will say there was only one chicken bone broth left and two beef, and I'm not a fan. I'm so. Yeah. It's just like grainy. <sighs> no. No. Okay, we're going with the chicken for the rest of today. On my way to my nail appointment, and I'll see if they let me film, but. I'm hoping they have the colors I want and can do what I want, but either way, I'm sure it'll look great. But when I get my nails done, they're always nice, so this place has pretty good reviews. I've walked past it every day for like over two and a half years, so hopefully it's actually what I want. <laughs> I have to share how incredible this view is right now. I don't know if it'll show up on camera. That's what I'm talking about. Look at the mountains. Oh my god, it was so cloudy yesterday. Uh, from the rain that I couldn't actually see them. Oh my god, they're so bad. It somehow got even better. Here we are. Hello. Hello. Just got done with my nails, but look at the sky, oh my goodness. So it stopped raining and it's just stunning. And since it's the waterfront nail place, this was literally my view during my nail appointment. So this is pretty amazing. Are we ready for a nail reveal? 
Yes. So funny. Look at them. I actually really, really love these. I was gonna do the reveal at home, but it's so beautiful out right now, and I'm like looking at them, and it's just they're so perfect. So I went with a mauvey taupe cap, not taupe. It's like mauve, basically, and it's purple. And then a shimmer on the ring finger. I love it so much. I even wrote down the names of these colors so that I could remember it. Yeah, these turned out absolutely beautiful. So, yeah. Hello vlog, it's been a couple of hours. I haven't filmed anything since I got my nails done. I came home, ate some food, tried to do that at the pace that I'm supposed to do it at now. And yeah, I just am obsessed with the nails still. And <laughs> I was looking at them in this light and just everywhere. And that is just a beautiful photo right there. My goodness. Candles are lit, watching lots of TV, relaxing. It's almost 8 p.m. So I'm gonna head to the hot tub for the night and we'll see if anyone's there and see if we can grab any footage from there. And yeah, that's uh, that's my plan at this point, honestly. Nice relaxing day. These are the first. Really good day, all in all, really great day. So can't complain. Hello vlog, I just got back from the hot tub even though I'm in the exact same place I think as the last clip ended, possibly. But I'm headed to bed. Uh, hot tub was great and relaxing. Gonna go to bed soon after I edit this video. It's only like 10 p.m. So I'm actually really tired though. I find that uh, recently I've just been getting exhausted very easily and just really sleepy and drowsy for some reason. I don't know if that's a side effect of the PPI I'm on or if that's just like my body trying to heal itself. Not really sure, but I'm sleepy and I'm excited to go to bed. I don't know what we're up to tomorrow actually. I want to deliver the Christmas things that like the cards that I have for our friends. So I think I'm going to try and do that if possible. If it's not absolutely pouring rain and freezing, we'll see. But tomorrow's just going to be a chill at home day. Uh, we did the nails, we did the hair, we, uh, we did the things that I was planning on doing. And I, every day I'm going to put a lot of energy into figuring out what to eat because I have to pay a lot more attention to that than I ever have. So most of my energy is going to be going into trying to figure out what my meals are going to be just to make sure I'm eating the right things that won't hurt me and eating things that just also keep me nourished and sustained because that's the biggest challenge I seem to have right now is trying to find things that will be nutritious enough to not only not upset my stomach but also just keep me healthy enough to be able to get better whenever I'm able to see somebody who can help me with this. But yeah, thanks for watching today and I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 12 and we will be halfway to Christmas.